Well, I believe that knowledge exchange shouldn't ever be developed in isolation. And occasionally in universities you can have, uh, I don't know, intellectual introspection where academics are working on really important things but doing it themselves. Whereas here at Edge Hill, we want to do that with other people with a real purpose, to have an impact on an issue in a community, whether that be in sport, whether it be cultural, whether it be in health, but always with a purpose. What we want to do at Edge Hill is to make sure that uh, we create something of a virtuous circle so that our research is informing the impacts that we can have on our communities, on society, on those kinds of issues, but also that we're able to take that knowledge that's been created with others, co-created, and put that back into our curriculum. It's been invaluable to have support from Office of Students and Research England, because what that enables us to do is to look at the model that we created with uh, Everton, for example, and see if that can be applied in other settings. So it's not just sport that uh, everyone's interested in, but can you get the same impact on mental health and well-being with young people through the arts, for example? And of course, we were able to do that with Tate Liverpool. It's been hugely successful, uh, and it's enabled us to say, yes, this framework works elsewhere. That enables others to perhaps take advantage of that uh, in different settings and be innovative around the way that the programme operates. It's really critical that when you're co-creating that you work very closely with those community representative and organisations that have exactly this shared same aims and values that you're striving to achieve and you really understand the impact that you're trying to have on a community and no one organisation can understand those issues and there are some that really do really understand exactly what's needed and Everton in the community is a great example of that and Tate as well so you've got sport and you've got cultural and artistic creativity as the drivers but mental health and well-being coming in from the research side and understanding what the impact can be through those uh, specific areas has been great. They've been wonderful to work with, but it's so critical that you do share the same aims and objectives.